Hey guys, so here's my Samsung Galaxy A51 The phone is still working But There's a software issue Even after factory reset Hard reset, still same The UI is like heavy So I'm going to restore And flash full firmware using Odin 3 on my laptop So Let's turn off this phone So I did backup everything put it on my PC so now let's connect the phone to the laptop so as you can see here's the original latest XME full files for my Galaxy A51 so now let's go to download file to launch the Odin 3 so here's my Odin 3 latest version 3.14.4 Open the folder, press once, press on the right mouse, run as administrator. I got this notice, and here we go. So I did enter the download mode on my Galaxy A51. Volume up to continue. The download mode alright so on here as you can see it shows this number com5 and added that means the phone already connected to the laptop so now let's import the four files here that means full files starting from dbl it means bootloader you choose this bootloader make sure your device model is correct bootloader first add it first and the second one ap it takes time to apply since the file is big 5.89 gb okay so it adds already now it's cp find the cp 25 MB only okay last but not least CSC so as you can see there's a two file which is CSC and home CSC for the CSE it remove all the data and for the home CSC keeps data so I will choose CSC for remove everything and make it like new alright so everything is finished and full files has been added here and check everything is good and now press start and hopefully it pass <laughs> super I'm not sure why that means so it take a bit time to full flash the firmware hopefully it pass and finally it passed for the full flash firmware on my Galaxy 51 First time ever booting a new software. So now it's on the welcome screen. Finally, I reach the welcome screen without any issue. All right, so far no issue for this new firmware, fresh one, same version as previous firmware, Malaysian XME, but way more smooth, more improved than previous firmware and now no issue and also seems like the battery are more improved than previous firmware very nice one i'm so happy no more issue and no more software issue and so before end this video you can give feedback for this samsung galaxy a51 flash new fresh firmware in the comment below and so that's all for me thank you very much and see you on next video goodbye and have a nice day